Hi guys, my name is Yogesh Prabhu and in this video I will teach you how to solve a determinant. So I have taken one determinant, okay, for a reference and I am just going to teach you the procedure to do it, okay. Pay attention. Uh, let us call this determinant as D. And determinant will always have one final numerical value, like determinant like this. So how do you solve this? What do you do is, uh, begin with the first point here, that's 2. So I'll write D is equal to 2. Now next is you will have to hide the column and the row of this element. So you'll hide first column and you'll hide first row. So when you hide this, you will see only 2, 2, 3, 5. So you draw a, 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 a smaller determinant, it's called as a minor. Okay, so it is 2, 2 and 3, 5. That's how you write the first one. Now after you take this number, next number you will take is 5. But be careful, you will take this as a minus 5. That's how you solve it, okay. So you write minus 5. Now, once you take this as a, this element here, okay, now you will hide the first row, hide the first row and hide the second column. So when I hide the first row and second column, all I see is 3, 2, 4, 5. And I'll write that down. So this is 3, 2, 4, 5. Now, same goes for the last one. Now we'll take this 3 and that 3 is taken as plus 3, okay. So this is plus 3. Just be careful. This 2 is taken as it is. 5 was minus 5 and 3 is plus 3 again. And now with this element, again, you will hide uh, the row and column of that element. So you'll hide this row and you'll hide this column. So what you see is 3, 2, 4, 3. Write that down. This is going to be 3, 2, 4, 3. So basically we did, uh, what we did is we converted this 3 cross 3, 3 rows and 3 column determinant, the original one, into the smaller ones. Now once you get to this level, okay, I'll just teach you how to solve this 2 by 2 determinant. This is a smaller determinant, right? So this D is going to be, this 2 will remain as it is. Now to solve this, you multiply these two elements first. These two. 5 into 2 is 10, right? And now multiply these two and subtract that. So it's minus 3 into 2, 6. I hope you followed this. I'll do it one more time. See this. It is minus 5. Now to solve this determinant, you multiply these two elements. And it is 3 into 5, 15, right? So 15 minus don't do it the other way around don't do 4 into 2 minus 3 into 5 it's always 3 into 5 minus 4 into that's minus 8 and then you have plus 3 and then you will multiply 3 into 3 that is 9 minus 4 to the 8 so basically we have reduced it in the normal simple numbers and we will simplify and get the answer for d so this is 10 minus 6 that's 4 and 4 to the 8 so i got the first one as 8 then 15 minus 8 is going to be 5, 7. And 7, 5 is 35. Is that correct? 15 minus 8 is 7. And then 7, 5 is 35. And then there is a minus sign over here. And then 9 minus 1 is 8. Uh, so 9 minus 8 is 1 plus 3. Right? So now D, the final answer of the determinant is going to be this. Now let us add uh, these numbers here. So it's 8 minus 35 is going to be minus 27. And plus 3, that's minus 24. And that's how you solve a determinant, okay?